Check one, two, check one, two, check one, two, check one, two. What is up, guys? Here it is, your boy Kagi back at it again with a new video. In this video, I bring you Theater and Arena, ladies and gentlemen. Play to earn game, brand new, just came out today, ladies and gentlemen. You can download it for Android, for iOS, and PC, ladies and gentlemen. I'm gonna use it for the PC. I'm on a PC, so I'm very, very excited to actually play this. So I'm gonna be live in just a little bit, ladies and gentlemen. But the first thing you have to do, if you don't know about this game, you have to go to the marketplace and you have to create an account. As you can see it right here, I have my account. I'm gonna log out and you can see that I have to connect my MetaMask. If you guys don't know, uh, you guys don't have a MetaMask, you have to search on YouTube how to install a MetaMask, how to get a MetaMask. So that's the first step. If you're brand new into NFT gaming for the people that are not brand new, very, very easy. You log into MetaMask, boom, log into MetaMask, boom, sign the transaction. When you actually make your account at the beginning, it's gonna ask you to link it to an email. It's gonna ask you to link it to an email because within the game, when you actually log in, you're gonna log in with your email. So it's gonna sync the characters that you have on your wallet with your email. So it's gonna sync it and that's the way you're gonna be able to play with your characters within the game. So now this game is on the Binance Smart Chain. So meaning that you have to actually change from Ethereum into Binance Smart Chain. Now, if you don't know how to do that, you actually go down here, you add network, boom, and it's gonna ask you to put the network name, new RPC, chain ID, currency symbol, block explorer, and all of that you can find it online. I'm gonna show you how to do that right now. So ladies and gentlemen, you go to this website, academy.binance.com, I'm gonna leave the link down below, and you're gonna grab all this information right here. Network name, new RPC, chain ID, symbol, block explorer, and you're gonna input it right here. Once you input it, it's very, very simple. It's gonna populate up here. So you can go from Ethereum into Binance, and as you can see, there's other networks that I have put into my MetaMask, and that's it. Once you do that, you're good to go. And all you have to do once you're in the marketplace is switch from Ethereum, right, the mainnet, to the Binance Smart Chain mainnet. Now, you need BNB in your wallet now. You need BNB in your wallet so you can actually make transactions within the Binance Smart Chain. Now, to do that, you actually have to go to Binance.com. All right, so to get some BNB, you're gonna have to go to an exchange like Binance.com. There's many other exchanges that, that have BNB, right? You're gonna need BNB to make transactions within your wallet in the Binance Smart Chain. As you can see, I have a little bit of BNB just so I can make swaps and stuff like that within the Binance a smart chain um, network so now if you go to coinmarketcap.com and you go to the binance coin you can see all the way down here all the exchanges that have bnb so all you have to do once you buy an exchange the bnb that you need all you have to do is copy your wallet boom put it into exchange withdraw it and you'll get your bnb in your wallet ladies and gentlemen now something very very important the theater and arena marketplace is actually working on wbnb so if you want to buy a character right here let's say you buy you want to buy a common character let's go uh cheapest item you're gonna need 0.2 wbnb that's basically the same as bnb but it's called the wrapped bnb okay i don't know why they did it in wrapped bnb but the point is that you now have to get wrapped bnb now, to get Wrap BNB, it's very, very simple. You're going to have to go to PancakeSwap.Finance. You're going to go to Trade Exchange right here. And you can see that you can exchange from BNB in your wallet into whatever coin that you want. And you would go WBNB. Boom. And now you have to get WBNB. So make sure you get enough BNB in your wallet, right? Enough BNB in your wallet so you can swap from BNB to WBNB. It's a one-to-one, -one, but you wanna have enough, you wanna have enough to go buy the character that you want in the marketplace. So the cheapest character right now in the marketplace is $120 So in BNB. So you at least need uh, 0.2 BNB in your wallet, or at least 0.25, right? So you can have that extra, right? But the point is that you need enough BNB in your wallet as well, so you can make transactions right so you can make transactions it's very very important that you have a little bit extra at least 10 bucks extra or five bucks extra so you can make transactions this is gonna cost me something right it's a little bit of bnb that is gonna cost me just a little bit as you can see this is the amount that is gonna cost me 0.00014369 it's like cents literally cents it's gonna cost me cents but still you always want to have that extra a little bit extra of bnb in your wallet so that you can make transactions now for this one like i said you need wbnb to go buy in the theater arena marketplace now you can also buy theater boxes with thc this boxes right here actually give you heroes right so once you buy one hero um right here with wbnb then you can start earning within the game and then once you have enough thc 
which is a token that you actually earn in game. You can actually buy more heroes with that token that you earned in game. So it's very, very interesting. And also you can sell the THC if you want in the marketplace. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so this is the first thing I get as soon as I log in. Let's see, I guess these are free heroes. Let's see, claim. So you can play this game for free. There are some free heroes that you get, but they're not gonna earn you as much as heroes that you bought from the marketplace, okay? All right, ladies and gentlemen, so let's take a look at the characters right here. I already played a few games with a free character, so you can play this game for free, and I have earned THC. I have earned THC, but I have earned it from the season, from the season pass. So as you can see right here, as you upgrade, as you level up, you actually get THC. You get the THC coins, but, but I'm not sure it has any bonus or anything. So as you can see right here, it has no winning bonus. It has no nothing. It has nothing. It has nothing. So I'm guessing the earnings actually come from the season pass. You actually get it from the season pass. From the free season pass, basically. Now, if you have paid characters like mine, you can see right here that this one has a winning bonus. So if I win, I actually get 23 THC. And then on top of that, obviously the season pass uh, coins. So you actually get that bonus, right? So that's that. Um, if anybody knows any other details about this, please in the comment, make sure you comment, make sure you comment below. Very, very important. Very, very important. Okay. Now this upgrade right here, I'm not sure what it does. If I upgrade this, maybe I get more winning bonuses. Maybe I I'm not really sure what the upgrade entails yet. I'm not really sure. If anybody knows, please leave it in the comments below. I know a lot of people engage in this game that know way more than me but I'm still learning. I'm still learning, ladies and gentlemen. So as you can see, this is a paid character. This is a character that I can use daily, 18 battles. It has a total um, of 769 battles. So once it reaches that point, I cannot use it anymore. So it is an investment. So you invest in your characters, you earn the THC, and then the THC, you can either buy boxes, you can um, switch it to THG and sell it for money, I believe. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so as you can see right here, I have earned 10 TAC. That is $16, ladies and gentlemen, $16. Holy crap. All right, all right. So if I go from TAC. Oh, minimum convertible, 750. You need 750 to convert it right now. So you would convert it to THG right now. Okay, I see. All right, got it, got it, got it. So there is a start claiming for your token after one hour and 58 minutes. So I need to first have 750 minimum THC to actually convert it. Wow, pretty cool, pretty cool, ladies and gentlemen. Pretty cool, pretty cool. So um, I'm probably going to go live. I'm probably going to go live and I'm going to start playing with my paid characters that Don't I actually give me more team. earning bonuses. Um, so I can reach that 750. I'm going to go live. I'm going to go live. Anyways, guys, I hope you guys um, enjoy this. I hope you guys enjoy this game. I hope you guys find value in this video. I know it's not a fully, 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 fully like explaining all the whole wazoo of the game because I'm still learning too. I'm still learning too. Right here, you got the skills too. Pam, pam, pam. You can switch your skills, etc., etc., etc. But for now, I'm going to keep it simple. I just want you guys to understand that the game is out. I want you guys to at least try it. Download it. Get involved. Get involved. Get involved. I'll see you guys soon. Live and next video. Peace.